Welcome to I.O. Responds, guys. I'm Dave Wobble. I'm Michael McCrudden. And yeah, response time, guys. Welcome to the weekend at Dish. We got some cool response for you guys, so stick around. All right, right off the top, I have a beautiful comment from Club Jedward fan. Club Jedward fan. They want to know, what is your favorite TV show? My favorite TV show is Violetta, pronounced Violetta. I got it. I got that. No problem. What's your favorite show? Uh, you know what? I've always been a huge Futurama fan. Like, mm -hmm. it's for some strange reason, it just spoke to me, but then again, I'm a big dork, so. But, you know, as soon as you said that, I'm, I'm wondering, Mike, what's your favorite show that's ever existed? I know. I'm actually like a deer in headlights right now. I'm a, I'm a huge T. Oh, I'm actually obsessed with Survivor. That's, you love that's reality. So, uh, that's so true. Yeah. Okay, but what do you like? Do you like more? Do you like reality or do you like scripted shows? Uh, I'd say I'd have to be. Uh, I'm one of those weirdos who loves reality television. You have to pick a scripted show. Yes. Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, right now, I, like my week is full because I can't miss Mad Men and I can't miss Survivor. Like I love. I, this is the best season of Survivor I've I ever watched. Oh, I could see you watching Mad Men. Yeah, a little mainstream, Dave, and I'm not afraid to admit it. <laughs> All right, I got a nice comment. This one is really heartfelt. It is from Take a Chance and Do It. I owe. I need a favor. There's a guy in my school who had a heart attack two hours ago. His name is Kieran Campbell, and nobody really supports him. And I want you to please give him a shout out and wishes. Please understand. Kieran Campbell from a guy who's had a heart operation. Two of them. I hope you have a speedy recovery, guys. You know, these kind of things are, I think they're like, wow, that's, that's crazy. I hope everything's okay. I know. Yeah, I don't know. But either way, man, we're thinking about you. I Here. hope it wasn't one of our news stories that caused it. You were like, another teacher had sex with a student? No! Well, either way, guys, you know, our, our thoughts are going out to you, you know, and I'm glad that you're just a supportive friend and, you know. All the best, brother. All the best. All Get the best. well. Hootie hoo. Okay, so, uh, you know, you know how we got a good Facebook page and we've got like a good IO Instagram sort of thing? I'm on there. I write stuff. I reply I, to people on Facebook. I love it. I yeah. think it's great. Um, one of my fans sent me this photo. Uh, it says, D Waffle House Waffle House. <laughs> it's perfect. It's perfect. I've, I've been waiting, like, you know, like there's like the pancake house, and uh -huh. I've been like, when's somebody just gonna put my name on well, it? Well, no, that's a popular franchise in the States. If you ever drive through the, the like, every truck stop is a waffle house. Are you serious? And it's like your home. Are, are waffles really that popular in America? They are. In America? Because I'm like, eh, You should know. start doing, like, uh, some people do, like, concert venues. Miley Cyrus, <laughs> Dave does appearances at the waffle uh, house. At the waffle house. You know what? When I was a kid, we used to have this little waffle machine that looked like, like, make little hearts. Okay. That, that, right. that touched me. I used to eat a lot of, this sounds really white trash, I used to a lot, eat a lot of frozen blueberry waffles. They were so I good. I like the cinnamon ones. Yeah, you like that cinnamon one? Oh, Nobody liked oh the God. cinnamon ones. I love them. They were like, syrup was already made inside these things. We're Ew. Canadian, so we love the syrup. What is your favorite breakfast treat? Let us know down there, guys. Very important stuff. Very Let us important. know. Gotta start up. the day off healthy. So this one comes from Emily Wilkerson, and she says, ship name, the Mick Waffle. So I think that's that's a combination of you and me together. Right. Okay. If, if you and I were both captains of a ship, it would be called the Mick Waffle. I like that. But I don't know how we'd both be captains of a ship because we'd be competing with each other. You Big take time. night shift, I take day shift. Yeah, I like the night shift. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It would be like two days. The crew would know how to handle it. So it'd be like straight to the point and like a little bit like goofball, but then you would be like a mad hatter running around the thing. And it's not even doing anything, Captain. Like he's just entertaining everyone. <laughs> we would pretty much be pirates. Yeah. Yeah. Captain Drake Sparrow, you know. So yeah. one, one captain has to go down with the ship. So I'll be sure Dave's taking a nap when that happens. Just run into a thing and you're like, oh, Dave's off ship, he's napping, there you go, down with it. Thanks, Mike. So we got this photo from uh, Stephanie Braid. I want to give a big thank you because it's, you know, I asked you guys to draw me as a cat and you guys actually did. <laughs> this is unbelievable. Like, this is I love so it. They have the spaced out t-shirt. They got the bracelets on the side. And there you <laughs> the go. Bracelets. Lego my ego. I know. It's so good. Unbelievable. I love how they actually uh, took the spaced out and they tried to do it like the exact colors because it's like, it's all, it's very really good it's talent. Good, good for really you. Good. All right. And to close it out, we want to go to one of our top. Top, top commenters and 
totally awesome fan. She's got a big thing for Michael McCrudden here. No, does she? I think so. Oh yeah. my goodness. She loves us. From Julie Wong, eat me. Oh, that's Landy girl, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, I know what happened. She got in touch with Sandra because Sandra was selling jewelry in time for Mother's Day. She does this on a side business. Well, she bought some and then we all did like an autograph thing. We sent her like uh, this. Well, you can see it here yourself. There's Dave, there's Michael, Liam, the producer is even on there. Sandra blew a nice sexy kiss yep. and that made it all the way to her. I just I love it. That's crazy, yeah. So it was a good idea. I gotta love Sandra for that one. I was like, she's like, we're signing something. I'm like, for who? Like, is your boyfriend in the hospital or something yeah, like that? Yeah. We're like, yes, faster, get him to the hospital. <laughs> so we hope you liked it and uh, you There know. you go, that's a little bit of us to you. We can actually turn this virtual relationship into a physical one, a semi-physical one. <laughs> so we wanna thank you guys for checking out this awesome weekend video. We love doing this for you guys. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Mm -hmm. So we wanna thank our sponsor, Gone Viral TV. They make these weekend videos possible. So be sure to check them out. Also, I IO sells t-shirts now. Did you know that? How many of you have a shirt and you're wearing it to school and all your friends are so jealous? Let us know about that as well in the comments down below. Time Dave Wobble. I'm Michael McCrudden. And let's get riggedy riggedy ripped. Woo!